hey hey it's your girl Chrissy Kinique back again with another one today I'm gonna be doing a reaction video to Gucci Mane's the new album Whoppers 2 specifically his song Big Boy Diamonds featuring Kodak and London on the track now I know there's a lot of controversy going on with Kodak y'all I understand he's mad disrespectful he's he violated when it came to the whole Nipsey situation with Lauren. Like, yeah, he definitely, like, I'm agreeing with y'all 100%. He violated. But I am not into canceling our artists, especially when they have good music. Like, Kodak makes good music. R. Kelly makes good music. I'm not canceling them. I don't give a fuck about what nobody's saying. I'm going to listen to who I want to listen to, and I'm going to listen to people who put out good content. And that's just that on that. I don't have to like the person to like the music. And that's how I feel about Kodak. So, before I go any further, like, comment, and subscribe. Y'all already know the vibes. And let's get into it. <laughs> Big boy down. Big boy down. Big boy step on and step. Big boy down. I just want me change the time. She like the way I be vibing. This ain't real. I saw my TV in permanent. Bottom. Let's talk about this beat, though. Like, London. Hold on. This beat. This beat. Who chill? And the way how Kodak starting off on it, come on, come on. Okay, you know what? Gucci is the goal. Let's be specific. So, Gucci is definitely the goal as far as southern rappers. Like, Gucci is the reason why a lot of these rappers that are like in the industry right now are even here because Gucci gave them that first step, he gave them that first opportunity, he put mad niggas on. So, he could definitely claim the fact that he's the goal of the south. Like, facts, facts. Like, people be jacking, like, T.I.'s the king of the South. I'm sorry, but if anything of this generation specifically, Gucci's definitely the king of this shit. Because, uh, like, his roster, his roster of people who he put on is everybody who's been on billboards for the last, what, five years? Like, come on. That's just a fact. That's just a fact. Like... <laughs> I want the cash, I don't want the credit. I want to be low key and I want to get money. Simple. Like, if you're not on that type of time, you like, I don't even want to say if you're not on that type of time, you're a cloud chaser because that's not necessarily true. Like, if you're an athlete, you're going to be in the spotlight. If you're like, a popping ass artist are gonna be in the spotlight. That doesn't mean make you a clout chaser. That just means that you're popular within your field. What I plan on doing with my life, I am probably gonna be popular, but it's not that I'm chasing for that. Like the last thing I'm doing is clout chasing. If I was really clout chasing y'all, I could too. I would really be doing the most and I'm not even on that type of time. Like that's not my energy at all. I'd rather be low key and just get to the bag and like that line is a fact and i love that he said that i don't need none of this and just give me the money so what you think this is company how's it that big was coming up i call a rash and count the money i'm changing the time so what you think this is company how's it that big was coming up i call a rash pause 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 gucci it's not that people was just calling you ugly back in the day, like, look at you. Like, you were kind of, you were kind of hit, bro. You were. But now look at you now. You looking good. You got, you got one of the baddest, baddest females out here. Like, you, she, not only do you look good because you got in, her, like, your physical shape. And, like, when you got into your physical shape, your features look good on you. But then you got Keisha. As your wife, she's just like the little icing on the cake, okay? She make you look too good. Like, for real. Like, let's just really compare. Old Gucci, new Gucci. Old Gucci, Gucci with Keisha. Like, it's just like, Gucci, come on. It's not that they was just saying it. It's kind of like it was a fact. Just saying, pointing that out. <laughs> Oh, and 
I just want to point out the fact that Keisha is Jamaican. Okay, shout out to all my West Indian girls. <laughs> West Indian, Caribbean girls do it best. You already know the vibes, okay? You already know. <laughs> Try me. I'm a murderer and a burglar. Try me. I'm not a murderer or a burglar, but try me. That's all I have to say. London finesse this B.O.D. Like, this B is solid. This B is fire. Like, I fuck with this B.O.D. And then we have... It's like... I know it's on Gucci's album. Of course, it's Gucci's song. But Kodak has all three of the choruses plus a whole verse. And then Gucci just has one verse. So, it's kind of like Gucci's featured on his own song, Low Key. And it's Kodak's song mainly. But honestly, that's just fire. I fuck with it. I fuck with the song. It's a good song. Kodak rides the court like... That beat is fire, and Kodak is riding it the whole way through. Like, the whole way through. Comment below and give me y'all opinion on what y'all think of the song. Don't forget to like this video. And if you are not already subscribed, what are you doing? Subscribe to the channel right now. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Tell a friend to subscribe. Y'all already know the vibes. <laughs>